Hey, listen up, people. I'm only gonna say this once. They say this next oil is going to be better in just about every way than what we have on file now. And we need to step up our game if we want to stay one step ahead. Let's start with reviewing the usual suspects. Time to... Get our hands dirty. In December 2016, two new oil categories were introduced by the American Petroleum Institute, also known as API. CK4, which is an updated version of the previous CJ4 category and provides greater protection than its predecessor, and there's FA4, a new category that has been described by API as providing similar protection as CK4 oils, but in lower viscosity grades to meet the needs of next generation diesel engines. These new products have already helped fleets quite a bit. CK4 provides improved shear stability, oxidation resistance, and aeration control over CJ4 in the familiar SAE 15W40 and 10W30 viscosity grades. FA4 oils meet the same performance measures as CK4, but they also increase fuel economy in engines designed for the lower viscosity FA4 grades. Over three years in, these products have proven to be a boon to the industry. But what can we find on the horizon of engine oil technology? Any questions so far? Okay, now we're getting to our new suspect. Codename? Olive oil. As the automotive industry evolves, so too will the diesel application continue to pursue greater overall efficiencies. According to oil marketers, these new CK4 and FA4 oil categories are just the beginning of what's to come. Current SAE 5W30 oils in both CK4 and FA4 designs are available, which provide improved fuel efficiency over their 10W30 companion products. Testing on even lower viscosities such as SAE 5W20 is also revealing positive results. The experts say that as we look to the future, fuel economy, emissions reduction, and total cost of ownership through excellent oil durability and optimized maintenance will continue to drive the trucking industry. It is also believed that we will see a continued transition to lower viscosity synthetic blend oils, as well as full synthetic engine oil that will help trucking fleets maximize their total cost of ownership. One of the biggest concerns that manufacturers are sure to have will be the continued effect of government regulations, such as greenhouse gas phase 2 standards, which are planned to go into effect beginning in 2021. To that end, the next generations of engines will likely continue the trend toward lower viscosities, resulting in recommendations of 5W and 0W viscosity grades as early as the mid-2020s. I hope you got all that. Now, go find me this new oil. We don't want him to blindside us. Godspeed, ladies and gentlemen. Don't let this oil slip away. For more trucking equipment content, head over to fleetequipmentmag.com. Thanks for watching.